here we are guys back again we're in Europe now facing Vadoz um, I haven't even said anything I'm just gonna play the same tactic see how it goes um, unfortunately Chisholm Sanchez has left so I don't really have much depth in the uh, center back role so it looks like Salvador Ruiz is gonna have to come in I'm allowed seven substitutes <laughs> A lot of people are still injured, which is not good. So Daniel Goncavales can come in. Um, I'll tell you what, I'll leave him up there because Liam Thorne's unregistered. Bloody hell. I didn't realise, I should have thought through this a bit more before I started, but we'll just go like this. And I guess this will be the start of the game. So Europe, 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 here we go. Time for Europe. Let's get excited. So it says here, I fully expect Vettel to record an easy win. It wouldn't surprise me if they had two or three up by half time. Alright, so. We're not going to get through. This is just about. Just seeing where we where we rank. These Vettels are a great team. And we are a horrible team, unfortunately. So, Giant killers, I'll just say. We're a good team. Nothing else. So they're playing a a, a five three two. We are playing a four one three one one, and no instructions. So I'll tell the boys, good luck out there today. And I should have told them I have faith, but it's too late. So here we are. We're in Europe, Europa League. They're on already. And if they score now, which they haven't, but they still have the highlight. And it looks like they're gonna go for it. Nah, lovely, lovely tackle there. All right, no highlight yet, so we'll just push through. All right, Guerrero, Saban character, can't do anything with it. Here we go. Lack of the defense, Vidoli. Oh, it nearly pummels us. So since we've become a semi-pro club, I've signed a few people on deals. We're spending about $250 on weight as they score. Bloody hell, eight minutes. Um, we're spending about £250 on wages a week, which I know in the long run it's quite a bit of money, especially at this level, but I think we should have the finances, be able to do that for now as a part-time club. And eventually, in the future, we'll sort our finances out a bit more, but just needed wages, need to get some people down on permanent deals, so that way no one can leave and it also adds value so if people want to come in and swoop in, swoop in then they have no choice but to uh, no, no choice but to offer us a transfer and uh, we'll be telling them no unless it's something substantial I'll be telling them no I'll tell them um, you've been unlucky so far and that's good news so just pushing through Rui, Saban Karatera, Aguilera not looking bad um, Surprisingly, we've got a lot of possession. We're just not doing anything with it, which is very unfortunate. But uh, they're already making a sub, which is tactical, so I'm assuming they're just going to try and park the bus. Here we go. Frick, Vidoli. Oh, no, Brun scores. So they have scored again. So that's two away goals for them. So uh, that's very unfortunate. But I think about a 1,000 people rocked up today, which is good. It's quite good for our first game here. Alhana plays there. Look, it's going to go straight back to them. No surprise. Matthew Smith's got a Frankie. Frankie, seven carries to go, Captain. I think he's getting paid about £100 a week, but he deserves it. I'm not going to complain about signing him down for £100. I'll keep him there for as long as I can. Duarte. No, Duarte, why'd you lose it there? Vidoli. No, oh, Guerrero. You better not. You better not give yourself a red card. You are vital for the second leg. No, oh, it's just a yellow. Just a yellow, just a caution. Which are very good, but they do have the ball. They will continue to push forward. Brun, and what are we going to do here? They've got it. Vidoli, Bands, Brun, goal. Nothing we could do. 3 0, and that's pretty much sealed the game for them. So well, I'll just rest some legs. I mean, we're very unfortunate, to be honest, but I mean, that's. That's football. So what we'll do... I'm actually just going to try something here. Bring Philip Navas on. Uh, play like that. Uh, Martos Gutierrez can come off as well for Mr. Pino. He was great last year. 
And then I suppose I can uh, put Monte Griffo on, give Monte Griffo a run out. So I'll play more of a midfield, uh, less less defensive, just play more midfield, see if we can control a bit of a midfield battle. But I don't think we will. As you can see, they're on the attack again. Yeah, they've scored again. So what I'll do, I'll just attacking fluid, and then if if nothing comes from this attacking fluid, oh, there's nothing I can do, really. We're just bloody lacking right now. Bloody lacking, so 4-0 away. Uh, four nil home, sorry, so they got four away goals. There's no way we're gonna score four. Um yeah, that's here we go. Ugly arrow's gonna whip it in and no goal. Typical, typical, we're gonna run all the way back. Pointless highlight. Um if you look at the uh the stats, we weren't as bad as the score line reflected. That's all I can say to be honest. Not as bad as the score line score line reflected. So here we are. I'll tell them, don't look back, we were just unlucky, and they love it, so we'll go to the post-match, you expected to lose, not expected that, a defeat, I would say, we didn't say really hard to watch, no, I think the team put decent effort, yep, so there we go, absolutely smashed, not good, not good at all, battles, both their players scored two, um, not as bad as some of the other teams, but that's all you can do, um, I will leave you here, and I will bring you back to the second leg. Yo, 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 back again. Second leg of the Europa League. Obviously, this means nothing to us, but uh, what can you do? As you can see, there's a few people here we've bought in. Don't stress too much. We'll stick with the same game plan. Just deal with the game. Obviously, we're not going to get anything out of this except the money, so I'll say it's a big match. Um... Okay, so, yeah, die about that. Continue the team talk. Tell the boys, good luck out there, we're going to need it. Obviously, their morale is probably taking a big knock after what happened in the first leg. We're now playing away. We're getting 12k revenue. This game's on TV, so we're getting, I think it's like 12k for this game being on TV, which is excellent. That 12k will be used very, very substantially. It turns out our wage budget, too. I told us we were spending 250 Turns out we have uh, $3,000 for our wage budget. So, uh, I'm not going to complain now. I've made a few part-time signings. I've uh, brought in, I think it's like three or four goalkeepers. Because uh, obviously we've got Yusuf Alhana, but he's just not good enough. So I think we've brought in three or four goalkeepers who might be able to knock him off the perch. I will have to clear out my club before the season, so they've just scored again. We'll have to clear out the club when the season starts, but uh, apart from that, there's not much else I can do. We just get through this game. Just want to show. Obviously, this this game is not important, but I just want to show you the second leg just to see how we coped in Europe against a bigger team. Um, I think pace OP for them. See, pace OP. Absolutely ridiculous. One day we'll be able to have a decent squad. Um, there's a few good Gibraltarian players that I've been trying to sign, but none of them interested. None of them are interested because our club stature is so small. So they're not very happy with our stature. They say, "Look, you're not a big enough club. We're not going to sign with you." Apparently, half of them would rather be at no club. Um, yeah, apparently they'd rather be no club than any club, so. Uh, unfortunate for them, they're not making money. I don't know. Yeah, so they're not going to make any money, so that's their own fault. I've tried to offer them as much as they can, but obviously they could not care less. Still looking for a centre-back, unfortunately. Um, I did bring in a new midfielder and a new striker. I haven't really looked at the uh, I haven't really looked at the squad depth or anything yet. Just bringing in players on trials, getting their scout report through the trial, then seeing where they're going to rack up in the squad. Uh, Duarte puts one in. Oh, we're never going to bloody score a goal. Bands Vidoli, these two just destroyed us last time. Looks like they're going to destroy us again this time. 
So there's the dolly. He's gonna whip it. I told you. They're just so predictable. It's currently eight nil on aggregate. Bloody hell. Bloody shit is all I can say right now. Bloody shit. As horrible as bloody shit would be, it's just a joke. Absolutely frustrates the shit out of me, but you know, there's nothing you can do. Um, we just bring as many people on as we can. Now, oh, Pino, you can play up here. Phillips, come on. Just don't want too many injuries because of the conditioning, so I. Uh, Bring on some legs, there's nothing we can do, as I've said about a hundred times, but it's disappointing, you know, we pushed hard last year, um, got into Europe, got drawn against a hard team, and 8-0 loss, I mean, look at that, 8-0 on aggregate. So that's it, Europe over, alright, so we just don't look back. So Europe's done for us, if you look at that. Absolutely destroyed away from home. So, what can I say? Look, we're done. Let's see what we've got right. So we just got destroyed. No surprise. Alright, Gibraltar Phoenix defeat. Yeah. So, I have no real complaints. Yeah. No, never really expected. Alright, so, so I'm not too upset. Success was never on the cards. Obviously, it was a good goal. And then there you go, 80k. So that's that's really what we needed from Europe. So a very small season this year. We do have a friendly proposal from uh, Benfica. So hopefully Benfica will play us because there's a lot of money involved in that. But uh, yeah, I mean, what can I say? I don't know when I'll meet you guys. Maybe I'll, I'll probably have to meet you guys after the transfer window. So I'll figure out when the transfer window is. I'll meet you guys after the transfer window. I'm not sure when I'll be, but I'll, I'll surely you'll have a video up soon. I'll meet you guys after the transfer window and just see who I've signed, who's in, who's out, and see how we're going. Anyway, thanks for watching. Sorry about the disappointment, and I'll see you guys in the next video.